Hey guys, it's Michelle. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you had a Merry Christmas and got to spend some quality time with your family. Today's video is going to be the unboxing of my very first cloth and paper sub box. So if you want to see that, please continue watching and let's get into it. So when I ordered my December subscription box, uh, they gave me an opportunity to add any more items to the order. And that's what this is on top. So these are not a part of the sub box. These are my actual items that I ordered and paid for separately. So we're gonna look at those first and then we'll get into the sub box. So I'm gonna quickly run through these since the focus of this video is the sub box, but I just wanna quickly show you what I got in case you are thinking about purchasing these same items. So the first thing is this page marker in beignet. There is a nice ruler on the side. It's in white print, so it's very hard to see, but just so you know, there is a nice ruler on the side that you can use for drawing your lines and things like that. Next, I have the cloth and paper Ollie clip in white. It has a CP logo on the front, and this is a really nice striated pattern on the outside. This is just so elegant and sophisticated. I thought it would add a lot of style and class to my planner, and it has a magnet on the inside so you can group your papers together or whatever we use our Ollie clips for. So I'm glad to have that one in my collection. So next I have the top tab dividers and they are unmarked on the top, which is nice because you can use a label maker or just write on them and label them whatever you need them to be. And they're glossy on one side and matte on the back. They feel really good, nice and thick. And you get four of these in a set. Then we have the frosted document pocket. It is a top loader. So you can insert your documents at the top. I got this to store my documents that I reference frequently, but you could also use this to store your stickers or whatever else you want to keep handy in your planner. And this is the Today Dry Erase Tab Divider. So I really needed this um, just so I can quickly get to the current day in my planner. So I've been waiting on this to come in too. All right, now we can get into this sub box. Okay, so this is my packing slip and they always give you a nice little uh, journaling card. I got the same one in my last order. Okay, so this is my pen test sheet for the Pinspiration box. Okay, nice, we'll do those in a little bit. And then just some journaling cards. And um, I think this is a summary of what's in the December box. It is, that's exactly what this is. Okay, so this is just an undated monthly card that has a, a undated calendar at the top place to write the month and then important dates at the bottom. Okay, nice. This month we're reflecting on the past year's achievements and setting goals for the new year. What were your biggest milestones in 2022? Okay, mindset, a new mindset. Nice. That's what I like about cloth and paper. They just have the most insightful little cards that they include in your order and this is the freebie for december and it is another card holder so this one you can't choose the color or anything this one is in like a bordeaux and with my last order i got the one and i think it's midori or something like that but it was really pretty it's the exact same car, uh, card holder it's just in a different color and this is the paperweight so this is just a paperweight for your desk and it's stone. It's really nice, high quality. It feels good in my hands, it's nice and cool. And I like that it's small. I thought it was gonna be really, really big. Um, so I like that. Very, very nice, very high quality. All right, so this is the archive box that Brie and Ashley did a sneak peek on during the last happy hour. See what we got okay and all the goodies are in here 
And so this, I think, are the pans. I'm gonna do those last. I don't have any pans, which is why I subscribe to the Pinspiration and Planning and Stationery box, um, because I just wanna see what pans they have and which ones I like the best. So I'm gonna open those last and do a pen swap swatch for you. All right, so we have sticky notes, uh, and they're matte, and you get 50 sheets. Open these. All right, so these are uh, sticky notes, uh, today sticky notes and mats. You get 50 sheets. They're three by three. They're all the same, okay? And then it's a place to write the date at the top. Okay, nice. And I guess before I get into that, let me talk about this archive box. So the cover feels like cloth and uh, has archives on the side. And this is basically to store all of your supplies or if you wanna archive your 2022 uh, planner inserts, you can do that. What I plan on doing is storing all of my stickers and planner supplies that I am not currently using in here because I have a ton of them and I don't know where to put them all. But you can put this on your bookshelf. Just add some decor to your office. So nice, very high quality. I really like this. All right, so this is everything else that came in the December sub box. Um, so these are circle page flags, transparent and aspen. And I love these gray transparent sticky notes. I find those are the ones that I use the most in my planner. I love the aesthetic and the vibe. And my two favorite colors are aspen and ash, which is a darker gray. I'm really happy I got some of these. And these are an aspen and they're transparent. Circle page flags. All right, so these are some journaling cards. Okay, journaling card, another journaling card. And this just says, simplicity is ultimately a matter of focus. And it's a quote by Ann Voskamp, all right. This one is lucky, noun, a lucky find, okay. <laughs> noun, a lucky find, okay, good deal. And this is a January card. I was hoping I would get one of these, but this I think is a tent. So you have to bend it here, and then bend here, and then these two fit together, like so. And it stands just like that. Nice, nice, nice. So, you know, I find myself when I'm working and planning, wondering what day of the week it is or what day of the month it is. And sometimes I don't wanna switch to the calendar on my computer or pull it up on my phone. So I wanted something that would just sit right on my desk for a quick reference. So this is nice. Thank you, Ashley and Cloth and Paper. And I don't know what, these are greeting cards. Set of 15 cards and envelopes. Merci, bonjour, pensant à vous. Pensant à vous, there we go. <laughs> it's your French accent together, girl. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, so greeting cards. Let's take this off. You know, I love greeting cards, especially around uh, this time of the year during the holidays. It's just a nice classy way or elegant way to thank people for sending you gifts or doing something nice for you. And so on the front, okay, so on the front, this is a merci, okay? So it says merci on the front and it says merci at the top, a place for the date, and then you can write a nice note and you get several of those. So maybe about five each, because I think you get 15 cards total. And then this one says, bonjour. Bonjour, date, write your note. 
And then the last one is the word that I didn't pronounce that well. Pensant à vous, thinking of you. And then pensant à vous, thinking of you on the back with the place for the date and a line section to write your note. So these are really nice. And you have the cards. So this is something, yeah, you can just hand out in person or you can drop in the mail. Very, very nice. So I'm gonna add this to my stationery collection. All right, and we got a dashboard. All right, I do not need another dashboard, but this one is very elegant, it's pretty, and then I like that it's in black and white on a cream background. And what does it say? A contented state of being healthy and prosperous. Okay, cloth and paper increasing my vocabulary. And this is Reflection, an undated insert. It's a review survey, quarterly planner notes. Oh, ooh, ooh. let's see what these are. I love me some free inserts. How excited. All right, reflection. Okay. Reflection. There's a place for the date, area of focus, satisfactory level, importance level, achievements to improve. And then quarter one, two, three, and four. Oh, nice. Oh my gosh. Thank you, cloth and paper. Okay. And they're exactly the same on both sides, which is nice. So you get, it doesn't say how many sheets, but um, it's a nice little bit. Oh, very nice. Very, very nice. I like that. And note to self. And I see you Lux Page Flags over there. Screaming me next. <laughs> All right, note to self. All right, I got a little note, notepad, nice. Okay, and this paper is, is, is thin. It feels good. It doesn't feel like them Filofax sheets I was hating on last video, um, but it feels really good. And I like the muted tone of this color. It's like um, a, a green. Well, I guess you can see that it's green, but it's like a sea foam green. So it, it's calming to me because it reminds me of the sea and, you know, being at the beach. So this is really nice. And it's a place for the date at the top and just a little notepad I can keep at my desk. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And then some Lux page flags. All right, so I already have some Lux page flags. And I really like them. They're nice and thick. And these look like they're not transparent. No, these aren't transparent. You can't, you can't see writing through these. But they're really nice to highlight information in your planner and of course mark your page. And um, these are record Lux page flags and they're very luxurious. I really uh, love the quality, very high quality. Uh, and you get a set of three and they're 0.75 by one and a half inches. All right, CMP. All right, so now let's look at the pins. All right, guys, so these are all the pins that uh, came in the December Pinspiration box. And there's a pen test sheet, so I'm gonna do a little swatch test to see how these write. And I got these, like I said, because I don't have any nice pens. I'm using a Bic from the office supply store. And hey, I love my Bic, it writes on my transparent sticky notes and everything, so I uh, don't have an issue with that. Okay, so this one is, let me see if I can tell what this is. All right, guys, I cannot read the name of this pen because the cap is clear. So I'm just going to watch someone else's December unboxing video who has better eyes than me. And uh, I'll put it on the screen what they call it. All right. So this is the first one. Really smooth. Did not smear. 
and it's really smooth. I like the way that felt in my hand. This one's yellow, I'm gonna try that one last. Okay, this one is check mark 0 0.5. Okay, so that one writes a little bit thinner. It's not as smooth, but I still like the way that felt uh, on the paper. All right, so this one is in turquoise. And I can't tell what nib size. So guys, my camera cut off when I was doing the swatch test for this next pen. It's the Shan Spinball Gel Pen in 0.5. So I'm just going to write that one out for you now. It feels good. It's uh, not as smooth as the first one, but it feels good in my hand. Now this one does not have the name of the pen on it, so we're just going to do the swatch test real quick. Okay. And this one is yellow. Pen test, okay? So anyway, so these are the five pens. I don't know if any are my favorite. The first one I think felt the best. It just felt smoother on the page and that was this one here. So I think I like this one the best, yeah. Yeah, I love that. All right, so these are all the goodies that came in the December sub box. Lots of nice supplies to add to my collection. Apparently you can pause your subscription if you feel like you're getting too much stuff. I'm gonna leave it on for a few months because I'm curious to see what I'm gonna get. All right, guys, that'll do it. Thanks so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.